Yeah, that was, uh, that was definitely a tough one there, especially in the third quarter. Things went haywire for us on Sunday, and they took it to us. And uh, we definitely wanted to be ready to play today. And um, I thought we did. We came to compete, but uh, we're up early. I think we're up 10 or even more. But they have a heck of a team. I mean, they they, they give Harden the ball or Lynn, and everybody else is spotting up, and they're shooting the, the heck out of it. And uh, they have a good team. So we had to grind this one out. But I thought definitely uh, I had a lot of guys contributing, and that was a good team effort. How does, the, how does the game change when Mayo's facilitating like he is tonight? Oh, he was great tonight. I thought Mayo was phenomenal, making the right decisions off the pick and rolls, uh, getting in the lane, and uh, not forcing anything. And, uh, had two big shots down the stretch when he was open, uh, came off pick and roll, knee wide open, and the, the big three had top of the key. Uh, the big thing is for us, he has zero turnovers, which sometimes gets him in trouble. So just uh, made the right decision every time. So that was uh, that was fun. I thought I thought uh, Marion was the player of the game. Uh, really battled uh, Harden all night, uh, forced him to some tough shots. Um, I mean, he still got to the free throw line uh, every other time down. Um, but I thought from the floor, uh, tricks forced him to some uh, some tough shots. Did it feel good to beat them at their own game? It's like y'all, y'all basically beat Houston, Houston's own game. Yeah, I mean they're number. I think they're the fastest paced game in the, uh, team in the league. But we're number three, so I mean we we like a faster pace ourselves. We're not. We don't really want to grind out games. So we knew in both games it's going to be up and down and uh, some high scoring. Last game they did more of the scoring. Uh, and this game, uh, yeah, it was they were right there. I think well, the second half so, uh, was right there. I think uh, the second half was actually even in points, and there was uh, uh, a lot of points scored and fun up and down game. And come out, come out on the road trip, this um, is the biggest road trip of the season coming up. Yeah, I mean every game to us is, is really big. Uh, we got a lot of road games coming up, and we've been losing uh, some some close road games. So uh, we're gonna take the first one. And, Hopefully go in there resting a day off tomorrow um, and then get uh, get focused on Detroit and uh, hopefully squeeze one out and start uh, start the trip off on the right foot. It, it's a long trip. You still believe that anything can happen? Hey, you got to take it one game at a time. I mean, that's, that's what we're doing right now. You can't really look big picture because it doesn't really look that great. But got to be positive and keep working. Um, keep finding ways to win close games like this, and that definitely helps. Did this win at least keep you guys afloat? I mean, would have. Well, honestly, we're three and one against the Rockets. Uh, if we'd be three and one against some of the other teams, we'd be in great shape. So yeah, it was uh, it was definitely a good win for us, especially after what they did to us on Sunday. Uh, so yeah, it was uh, it was a fun win, but uh, now we got to show that we can win some road games. Looks like it got pretty chippy out there. Kind of frustrating. Well, it's it's a playoff game, really. I mean, that's every game for us now is big. We can't afford to lose it, especially, like I said, what they did to us Sunday. And uh, both teams play extremely hard there at the end and not really giving up an inch. And that's what the playoffs is all about, really. They started early for us, and um, that's how we got to approach it.